still watching the NT. Notice the 6E doesn't have that real strong sense of exhaustion if you look back a couple of bars before these last two, there's just nothing. It's just going completely sideways. So it's not, I got this um, NQ. So it's not, uh, not a real strong potential for exhaustion. I got plus five on that NQ. Any visitors here? Not clear on what we uh, what we did there. Just low of the day, George. Just your low of the day. This is a uh, this is a ninja trader indicator. Not even one of ours. So Jeff, you notice a speed tick on this bar. First, we had this push. Notice that th these bars are a bit longer than just the previous bars, and it's a straight push down. When we get a sudden, this this could be characterized as a sudden and unexpected event. This strong push down, this two bar push, and then we got this speed tick that tells us that the orders that had going through the um, exchange, okay, that doesn't mean orders placed, but orders that are processed go through the exchange faster than is likely us little retail traders could do it we get the speed tick here. Now, this little lightning bolt here on the open of this bar tells us that we have a divergent condition. So the condition is that, see, price is just continuing to drop, but momentum has actually gone the other way. So that tells us there's a good bit of exhaustion here, potential, having this divergent. So this is a very strong, powerful combination here. Yes, for the for that particular trade setup, I will use low of the day for support or high of the day. Only for that one. If we did not have the divergence here, ignore the fact that the speed tick disappeared. I did I, I have that to keep the chart clean and neat so people don't get too overwhelmed when they come visit with us. Um, but we had a speed tick and momentum here. For this setup, speed tick with flash, I will forego major support and I'll use minor support because it works so well and so often. All right, watching the GC. About to tag that high of the day. You have some nice momentum. Now, since it's only minor being the high of the day, I'm going to need a flash or a McDiver on the open of the next bar, just like that. So I did short the GC as a speed max setup of the high of the day. Had a nice strong push, had that third stage of momentum. That's that light gray on that bar. Speed tick, next bar open with the McDiver. We have our safety net in place. And plus five. Nice, Linda. It's about to say nobody else. It's a good setup right there. Nice, Jack.